Everybody share this post out immediately. I need everybody in my comment section with their opinions. Now, it ain't no secret for the last year that Jess has been being doxxed. For you guys that don't know, doxing is when you search for and publish private or identifying information about a person on the internet, typically with bad intent. It ain't no secret that everybody on Reddit has been posting the most hateful things I've ever heard somebody post on the internet about a person. You guys have talked about her dead family members and pulled up records from when she was a child. You guys have tried to post nudes about her and anything hurtful you can possibly find. I made a post on Reddit saying I'm going to do the exact same thing to you guys and all of a sudden I'm a piece of shit. But you guys can do it to her for the last year and you guys are upstanding citizens. Women are supposed to empower women. So why are women mainly the people that attack her? One year ago, you guys were posting on Reddit about how big of a piece of shit Jason is and how much you guys hate him. Now a year later, you guys are all on his coattail talking about how great of a dude he is. Calling me a bad person and a violent person because I had to do something in a situation that was either my life or his life in prison. A situation none of you guys will ever understand unless you were in my shoes. This dude literally has a charge for chopping up a body and getting rid of it. But he's a great dude, right? And he has multiple domestic violence charges, which means he ain't new to hitting women. I've never had none of that. You guys are so uneducated that you tried to make a post saying that I only did four and a half years when it is not that hard to look up my record and decide how much time I've done. And now a known gang member is making threats against Jess and her family. All because you guys want clout. How miserable do you guys have to be to put a woman and her children in harm's way? It ain't no secret that Jess is very aware of the mistakes she meant by involving herself with Jason. And she spent the last year of her life trying to fix that mistake. The more she tries to separate herself from Jason, the harder and more violent he becomes. And it's not helping the fact that you guys are taking a known gang member's word for it. All because you guys have a little distaste in your mouth for Jess. Y'all need to do better, but I don't expect it out of you. And that's facts.